Will the USGS has increased the Yellowstone supervolcano threat to high? This is the first time that the USGS has updated its volcano threat assessment since 2006. They're saying that the USGS is looking at 11 of 18 volcanoes that have been classified as a high threat or a very high threat that are all located in Washington, Oregon, and in California. Now, many of those covered in ice and snow, and they can they can send those things hurling you know, hundreds of miles in some instances, depending on the small fragments, and anyone that's close by, it can really affect a densely populated area. Now, top of the list is Kilauea in Hawaii. You may recall this is one that has started to erupt here recently and had an ongoing eruption for months. It has since died down. They also list Mount St. Helen, Mount Rainier as being two key volcanoes on the West Coast, as well as California's Mount Shasta. Now, they've raised the threat here of Yellowstone to high, but it's not listed as the most dangerous in terms of imminent eruption. Like I said, Kilauea had an ongoing eruption, and we've seen some of the devastation from eruptions like Mount St. Helen in the past. If it was to let off an eruption of the same degree or worse, it could cause some problems in the area. Now, of course, any time a volcano erupts, it can cause flight delays, things like that. But I thought it was interesting that they put out this update. This is the first time since 2006 they've done so. There's a full list here that you can check out at this link that I'll leave below in the description box. And also make sure to follow me on Twitter for more. It's been Dabu7. Peace.